Hello, I'm Angie Carchisi, and this is your UWW-TV News Update. Spring is officially here, and with it, the hope of warmer weather and positive progress with regard to the pandemic. The university is once again reminding students that we must remain vigilant and safe as spring break approaches. This year's spring break will be held on April 19th through the 23rd. They ask that everyone at both the Whitewater and Rock County campuses to continue to follow the principal outline in the Warhawk Social Covenant. This includes wearing face coverings, maintaining social distance, washing hands frequently, and staying home if you do not feel well. While considering the concerns related to having students leave Whitewater campuses and return to their community, the EOC would like to remind students that travel protocols are still in place. These protocols include getting tested for COVID-19 before you travel and immediately when you return. Do not travel if you are COVID-19 positive and while on vacation, continue to take precautions with facial coverings, social distancing, and washing your hands frequently. After spring break, students will return to campus for about three weeks to complete classes, final exams, and commitments. As always, the university will continue to monitor the status of COVID-19 and if conditions change, the university will work with students and the surrounding community to respond as necessary. We'll have more news after a quick break. Individuals who wish to receive an exemption from the COVID-19 testing due to being fully vaccinated should now submit their immunization record through my.uww.edu backslash vaccination. Individuals at UW-Whitewater are exempt from testing if they are fully vaccinated, asymptomatic, and has sent a copy of the Wisconsin immunization record to the COVID-19 hotline office. Once your information is submitted to the COVID-19 hotline and you have received verification of the receipt, you may cease testing. If you begin to feel COVID-19 symptoms, you are expected to have yourself tested to ensure the safety of others and assist in the national evaluation of the vaccine. Due to the strong demand for COVID-19 vaccines, all of the available appointments for this week's on-campus vaccination clinic at the University Health and Counseling Services are filled and the registration page is no longer accepting appointments. At this time, the University is requesting additional vaccine doses and will continue to notify our campus community of vaccine availability. If students are interested in receiving a COVID-19 vaccine, SSM Health in Janesville is still accepting appointments for UW-Whitewater students, faculty, and staff and for general members of the community. To make an appointment, please visit www.ssmhealth.com backslash access backslash COVID-19 vaccination schedule. For more updates, stay tuned to UWW-TV. Check us out at uwwtv.org or tune into the 24-hour stream at uwwtv.housing.uww.edu. I'm Angie Carchisi, and this has been your news update on UWW-TV.